Good morning, everyone. Good morning. My name is Kathy Helmuth. We're here today to run our Parkinson cycling class or pedaling for Parkinson's. We all have different availabilities. Isn't this just so fun? So we have a group of individuals that are at our local facility, our Sarasota Y. We have one, two, three people who are individually riding at home. Stacy will be joining us shortly, I think. Marsha, you're joining us from Virginia, right? Is that right? Great, great, great. And Tom is on his outside bike, which is so cool. So this is an opportunity for everybody. Yeah. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go ahead and get started with the warm up. So what I'd like for you to do is begin bringing your RPM up as close to 70 to 75 RPMs as possible. Tom, be careful out there, buddy. And we're going to do this for three minutes. So what I want you to do is I want you to begin your warm up 70 to 75. I want you to choose your gear that you feel is warm up gear that's efficient for you. Carolina, you're just joining us back again. You be mindful, okay? Try to get that RPM up just a little bit faster. I can tell the way that you're pedaling right now, you're not quite where you need to be, but take your time getting there, okay? Okay, great. Phil, Betty, Vince, great job. No will today, I see, so I'm sorry to see that. Not um, he may come in a little bit later, so that's absolutely great. Okay, guys, so keep going. Keep going, you're almost, you're almost a minute into this, beginning of the warm up, 70 to 75 RPMs with what you've chosen for warm up gear, okay? So as we continue through this, I'm gonna share with you what we're gonna be doing next, just so that you know what's coming next on the warm up. We're gonna be taking a two minute pedal drill at that point. So we wanna finish this up, we've got another minute right here. So we're gonna do another minute with just a nice warming the legs. So remember, all we're doing is starting to build the demand for oxygen in our lower bodies, starting to lubricate our knees, starting to lubricate our ankles. Great, how's everybody feeling? Everybody is okay so far, right? Okay, good, 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 good. Remember, we wanna take our time warming up, especially if you're just joining us again after we've had this long break. So we want to take this opportunity just to kind of continue to warm up. Wonderful job. You're almost, you're almost now two minutes into the warm up. 70 to 75 RPM. Stay right there, please. Excellent job. Vince, you're, Vince is looking great. He's looking fantastic. Good job. Good job. You're two minutes in. You have one more minute now at 70 to 75 RPMs. We wanna stay right there, guys. Everybody's still feeling okay. Good job. Hey, Phil, how's your watch working? Is it good? Good? Okay, now remember, we wanna keep that heart rate a little, little bit lower today, right at the beginning. Try not to warm up, try not to bring that heart rate up too fast. We're gonna bring it up slowly. Great job. Everybody looks great today. Everybody looks great. Good job, Ooh. three more seconds to go. Now we're gonna take this opportunity in 30 seconds to add a touch of gear to the right, and we're gonna slowly build our RPM up just a little bit faster. So right now you're at 70 to 75 RPMs. Go ahead and add a touch of gear to the right. It's not gonna to totally change the muscle recruitment, but you're gonna feel a slight difference in the pedal stroke. Now you're gonna build your RPM up to 75 to 80 RPMs. And you're gonna hold that as you focus on the pedal stroke. So as we focus on the pedal stroke, we wanna keep flat feet. We wanna draw the energy up and over the top of the pedal, drop it down on the front side, bring it back like you're wiping up the bottom of your foot as you come in outside. Good. Who even wipes their shoes anymore, right? We don't even wipe the bottom of our shoes anymore. We always take them off before we come in. So maybe that's not a good, good thing to say right now. So you're 30 seconds in, you have 90 seconds to go. Stay right here, guys. Shoulders are down, chest is up. Good, 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 good. Everybody focusing on where their RPM is and how the smooth pedal stroke continues right around that, that perfect circle that we have right there. Looking good. Phil, Betty, Vince, you are looking fantastic. Great job there, good job. 
My kind of quiet your upper body just a little bit. Quiet. <coughs> That's better. Thank you. Thank you for that. One minute to go, guys. After this minute, we're going to take about 45 seconds to grab a drink of water, and then we'll begin the first block of work, okay? Carolina, you need to bring up your RPM just a little bit faster if it's available for you to do that. I'm not sure how that's working for you. Okay. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Young guys, all look fantastic. How does everybody's legs feel? It's starting to get warm. Good. Good, good, good. Shoulders down. Heart rate coming up slightly, but remember, we can complete a com complete sentence here. We're not working hard. Okay, you got 20 more seconds to go. You're gonna keep this gear that you have right now, and you're just gonna be slowing down to about 70 RPMs in 10 seconds, and I'm gonna have you take a moment to get a drink of water. Seven, good. Five seconds, good job. Three, two, pull back 70 RPMs. Don't drop your gear if you can help it. And now we have 45 seconds just to take a moment, rethink how we're feeling, and we'll be going from there, okay? So uh, we have this, we've, we've done these classes before. We've done ex the exact same profile that I'm gonna offer you today before when we were all together working together um, before all of our lives changed. So you may feel like you, your body feel, this feels familiar, that's good. And if it doesn't, just listen to my words and I'm gonna coach you through this. Okay, so here we go. In 15 seconds, I'm gonna go ahead and have you bring your RPM up to 80 RPM. So slowly, if you're ready, bring that RPM up to 80 RPMs. Now hold that, hold that right there. Good job. Okay, great, I'm glad Will's here, good. Okay, so seven seconds to go. You are now at 80 RPMs. Now we're gonna be adding 10 more RPMs on. So get ready using that same gear that you left. Here we go. 90 RPM, start building your RPM to 90, 90. Tom, be careful out there on the road. 90 RPMs is super fast. Good job. <laughs> good job, good job, good job. Now hold this, hold this 90 RPMs. So this totally changes that muscle, those muscle recruitments, doesn't it? You have to really focus, mind to body here. Good job, good job. Shoulders are down, shoulders are down, chest is up. Let's go. You're now, you're now working towards another minute right here. Another minute, you're at 90 RPMs. Try to quiet your upper body. Try to focus on that puddle stroke, bringing it around. Good job. You're excellent. Keep it right there. So this is just coming in out of the warm up into the first block of work. This is giving us the opportunity to really feel like how the class is gonna go today. And you are doing fantastic. 30 seconds to go. Great job, great job. You're at 90 RPMs. Listen for the change because it's coming. Good job. Excellent, everybody looks fantastic. Good job, good job, good job. Everybody looks fantastic. You're going fast. Marsha, I can see you're working. All righty, all righty. Start pulling back 80 RPMs. Now hold that right there. Hold that 80 RPMs, just hold it. Good job. Don't change your gear, don't add gear. If you need recovery, you take it. If not, we're gonna go back to that 90 RPMs again. We're gonna try to focus like a flat road. So you gotta think about a flat road in front of you. Tom, I hope you don't have any turns out there on the road. Here we go, straight ahead. It's gonna be a straightaway right in front of us. Let's go, 90 RPMs, we're going again. We now have one minute, 11 seconds to ride at 90. Good job, warming up, warming up, warming up, transitioning into the work. You guys are awesome, keep it right there. Everyone looks great. Hey Will, great to see you. All righty, stay right here please. You're at 90 or as close to 90 as you possibly can. Betty, you're doing fantastic, you look great. Elbows are soft, guys. Hands lightly placed on the bars, you're looking fantastic. Good job, good job, good job. Wonderful, stay smooth. Stay smooth at 90, you look good, you look good, you look good. Great job, great job, great job. 30 more seconds to ride, 30 more seconds to ride at 90. Brilliant job. Hold it right there. Good, good, good. Will, you need your head up, buddy. Head up, buddy. Good job, shoulders are down. Good job, 20 seconds to go. We're gonna slowly begin to bring our RPM down. Stay with it. 
Start bringing it down, 85 RPM, start bringing it back. 80 RPMs, pause right there at 80 RPMs. Rethink how you're feeling. You have one minute till recovery. 80 RPMs, excellent job. So this is how you should feel. You should feel like you did a good effort, but you were never out of breath. Is that correct? You felt like your legs are starting to warm up and you're working to your, through your warm up potential, getting ready to work a little bit harder. You are absolutely fantastic. Good job. So begin to now think about recovery. So we're at 80 RPMs. If you have power on your bike, you're gonna remember your power number here. If you have gear on your bike, you're gonna remember your gear that you were at. If you don't have either one of those options, what I'd like for you to do is I'd like to remember your intensity level, how you feel right here or your heart rate. So in 10 seconds, we're gonna come all the way down to 70 RPMs and we're gonna hold the recovery steady. Four seconds, three, two, 70 RPMs, I want you to stay right here at 70 RPMs. Get your water. How's everybody doing? Everybody's good? Phil, Betty, Vince, Mike, Will, great job. Tom, how'd you do on that? Is it scary out there, buddy? Okay. <laughs> Carolina, how was it? Was it good? Did you do okay? And Marsha, good job. Okay, great. So let me share what we're gonna do as we move out of this recovery and into basically the first stage of the workout. So we are now 10 minutes in. We still have about 10 more minutes until we're really saturated with our oxygen. And our oxygen um, becomes a little bit easier to uptake to our muscle fibers. Here comes Stacy. we're glad to have you here. Okay, so what I want you to do is think about where you were with the gear, with the power number, or with your intensity level. Start building your RPM back up to about 80. Now find either your power number, your heart rate, stay right there now. Stacy's gonna connect, she's gonna be able to join us. Good job. So hold your 80 RPMs right here. So from eight, we're gonna go through this two times. It's gonna be 80 to 90, 30 seconds. Each time adding a gear as we pull back to 80. Then we hold that 90 RPMs for one minute and we repeat that same option. So you can tell this is gonna get a little bit harder. Is that correct? Is Betty okay over there? Betty's okay? Okay, good. Everybody, enough gear on at 80 RPMs. Enough gear on at 80 RPMs. And now what I want you to do is I want you to bring your RPM up please to 90, 90. So this is gonna feel just like it was at that very last effort that we were doing as we accelerated to 90. So you've got 30 seconds at 90. So you're really pushing 90 RPMs, okay? Same gear as you left at the end of that last effort. Everybody good. So you're seeing a power number surge and you're seeing a heart rate lift, but you're not out of breath. Is that correct? Is everybody good? Okay, great. Pull it back, 80 RPMs, touch your gear to the right, make it a little bit harder. You now have 30 seconds. Hold it right there. Good job. Excellent job, excellent job. Great. So you know where I'm gonna go next. You know I'm gonna accelerate you again. This is gonna be a little bit harder. Marsha, are you out of breath? All right, be mindful. Okay, here we go again. Carolina, here we go. Here we go, five, four, three, to 90 RPMs, go faster. 90 RPMs, you've got new, that new gear on, good job. All you have is 30 seconds. That's all you have, 30 seconds. Good job, good job. You have 15 seconds. In 15 seconds, I'm gonna ask how you're feeling. Great, 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 great. Okay, in 10 seconds, I'm gonna ask how you're feeling. Are you okay? Go ahead, add another gear if you can. Touch a gear to the right, keep your 90. 30 seconds, finish up. Good job, good job, good job, good job. Come on, move that, move it, move it, move it. 90 RPMs, you're awesome, you're awesome, you're awesome. Be careful out there, Tom. Good job, it looks like a beautiful day out there. Good job, 14 seconds, good, good, good. Carolina, speed it up, sweetie. Speed it up, honey. Good job, seven. Four, don't leave me. Three, 
two, pull back 80 RPMs, you have 30 seconds, don't change your gear. Even if you're slightly out of breath, don't change your gear. 80 RPMs, hold it steady. Oh my gosh, fantastic job. Good job. Okay, great, you've got 15 seconds here. We've got another acceleration to 90. Are you about ready to go? Isn't this fun? Isn't this fun? Good job. <laughs> Five seconds to go. Four, three, two, 90 RPMs. You're going 90 RPMs for 30 seconds. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Good job, good job, good job. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Okay, so now write this, how you should feel right here is this feels like harder work, correct? This feels like you're opening your mouth to breathe, right? And you're working to your potential right here. We lost Tom, oh shoot, I'm sorry. Four, three, two, 80 RPMs, hold it, hold it, hold it. Are you good? Are you good? Okay, now we're gonna accelerate, pull back. Accelerate, pull back, accelerate, pull back. You're gonna get recovery. Are you ready? Let's go, 90 RPMs, let's go. You have 15 seconds, let's go. Go, 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 go. Tom's coming back to join us. I'm so excited, good. Here we go, five, four, three, two. Slow it down, 80 RPMs, you have 15 seconds. Wow, awesome, we're gonna do it again. We're gonna do it again, it's gonna go 90, it's gonna push 90, it's gonna push 90, here we go. Five, four, three, two, 90 RPMs. You're pushing now, you're pushing now, 90 RPMs. Vince, get your head, tell Vince to get his head up. Will, get your head up. Good job, good job, good job. Five seconds, four, three, two, pull back 80. This is the last one. I want you to remember what your power number is here at 80 or your effort is at 80 or your intensity is at 80 RPMs. We're gonna re Come back to that at the beginning of the next opportunity. Here we go. Go, 90 RPMs, you have 15 seconds, push. 90 RPMs, you have 15 seconds, you are amazing. Keep it right there, keep it right there, keep it right there. Great job, great job, you have six seconds to go. Four, three, two, recover. Go ahead, 70 RPMs, 70 RPMs, brilliant job. Marsha, you look exactly like you were supposed to look. Good job, good job, good job. Wonderful, great, good. Phil, how did you do with your heart rate? Did you do okay? Good, Betty, are you good? Did you get it all set up? Is your bike okay? Yes, fine. All right, okay, Vince, Will, Will, get your head up, honey. Even on recovery, we're getting our head up. Good job. Uh oh, we lost Carolina, she left. Okay, sorry, Carolina, hope you're okay. Stacy, can I'm hoping there she is. She just went to get a drink of water. <laughs> her heart rate water. That would have been nice, Carolina. Good job. <laughs> All right, guys. Now wasn't that fun? Wasn't that good times? Yes, of course it was. <laughs> I hear you. That's wonderful. Okay. So now we've got a four minute block in front of us as we leave our recovery. Our four minute block will not feel very intense for the first two minutes, but it will feel more intense on the final two minutes. So remember what I asked you to remember, 80 RPMs, wherever your, your power was, wherever your gear was, wherever your intensity level was, that's where you're gonna go back to. And then we're going to increase it from there. So this opportunity is gonna be available for you to build up that heart rate just a little bit higher. Phil, we're not going sky high yet, okay? We're not going sky high. We're gonna keep a lid on it, but we're gonna work harder than we just did. Okay, so let's go. We've got 80 RPMs. You've got 10 seconds to find where you were the last time you were at 80, does that make sense? Does everybody have that? Okay, are you there? Give me a thumbs up when you're there. Okay, good, 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 good. Excellent, let's begin guys, let's begin. 80 RPMs, I want you to keep your intensity level right there for two, we're gonna do it for two minutes. 
So we're gonna slowly build the, the RPM up slightly just to make it feel a little bit harder, okay? Everybody's got your power number, everybody's got your gear, everybody's got your intensity level, everybody's got their heart rate under wraps right here, right? So just, I'm just gonna have you accelerate. Don't go to 90, don't go to 90, just hold that, hold that right there. Keep, keep yourself under 90, but keep yourself faster than 80. I know for some of you, you've got it spot on because you have a monitor on your bike. Others, it's a little bit more difficult, that's okay. Now hold it right there. So you are now 45 seconds into this. So this is how you should feel right here. Mouth open to breathe. Effort is moderate to moderately challenging. Is that correct? Good. You have broken a sweat, and if you haven't broken a sweat yet, I'm gonna ask you why you haven't broken a sweat, but I don't really want an answer. Just ask yourself why. If you're feeling good today, you should be breaking a sweat right here. Okay, good. Hold it right there because we have 50 more seconds. 50 more seconds at 80, okay? Great, hold it right there. Hold it right there, shoulders are down, you come back to 80 now, you come back to 80. Good job, good job, good job. Okay, one more time, I'm gonna ask you to accelerate just a little bit faster, keeping it under 90. Think about what you're doing here, because now we have mind-to-body connection, so we're accelerating faster than 80, but we're keeping it under 90. We don't know exactly where we need to be, but just keep it steady right there. Excellent job, 18 more seconds to go, brilliant job. Good job, good job, good job. Mind-to-body connection right here. This is so good for our focus. Focus, focus, focus. Seven, come on now. Remember I told you, moderately to moderately challenging. Okay, pull back to 80, hold it right there. We've got two minutes left of this workout. Two minutes left of this block of the workout, okay? And we're gonna work harder. You are now 20 minutes into your workout. This is the time when you can really build intensity now, okay? 20 minutes. Saturation of oxygen, good. Oxygen uptake, uptake's gonna be available. So put some gear on that bad boy. Put some gear on now at 80. Put some gear on. Good. Remember I told you this, these two minutes, we're gonna be working harder. Good, so you've got your gear on. Your pedal stroke has changed slightly. You may be have had to adjust yourself on your saddle. All right, now let's start building the RPM up. You're gonna keep yourself below 90, but you're gonna keep yourself above 80. Okay, everybody got it. Now hold it right down. Now hold it right there. This is intense right here. This becomes intense. Just hold it right there. We've got one more minute. Now, start thinking about how you're feeling. This should be moderately challenging to heart. This is how it should feel. You control the gear. You control the how the heart rate responds. 43 seconds to go. This is moderately challenging to hard. Is that where you're at? And if not, add some gear. Good job, 30 seconds to go. You're gonna get two minutes to recover in 30 seconds. Good job, good job guys, good job. Right there, right there, good job. Hold it right there, good. Good, hold it right there, guys. Hold it right there. 13 more seconds to go. Remember your heart rate here. If you have a heart rate monitor, remember it. Five, four, three, two, recover. 70 RPMs, take your gear off. You now have the opportunity to recover, hydrate, towel off. Fantastic job. Good job, good job, good job. Wow, how do you feel? Do you feel fantastic? Good, good. All righty, great job, great job. Stacy. I hope you're doing well too. I hope you're doing well. I'm gonna see how Stacy's doing. Good, you okay, Stacy? Can you hear me okay? Okay. All righty, how did it, how'd you, how did it go? Did it go well? How'd you feel? Did you feel good? Everybody felt good. Okay, okay, great, great. So just to recap, we did those short little intervals, those 30 seconds. We brought it on board for a minute. We, we took a little bit of opportunity to recover and we took a big four minute block to work. So now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take the harder part 
at 80 RPMs. We're gonna lighten our gear and finish up at 90. This is a four minute block as well. You're gonna feel the intensity at 80 RPMs and you're gonna drop some gear after that as we move into a 90 RPM opportunity. So it's gonna be almost slightly different than what we did, right? We were easier work at 80, harder work at 90. Now it's harder work at 80, lesser work at 90. Crazy, but it's good. It's all good. Okay, so are you guys about ready to go? 26 more seconds and then we're gonna begin. It's gonna be another four minute block. If I'm asking you to work too hard, you're not gonna do it, you're gonna pull back. You can always drop your gear. Try to stay with the RPM, however, if you can. No lower than 80 RPMs, okay? Try to keep that, keep that focus right there. Okay, here we go. Go back to 80 RPMs. I'm not gonna begin the timer yet because I want you to start adding in your gear. Start adding in your gear until you feel like you're recruiting the top of your legs, the hamstrings, and you can even feel your calves. You have to focus on bringing your pedals around nice and smooth, and you feel like you're beginning a climb up a hill. Would you say that? Okay, so now I haven't started the timer. The interval hasn't started yet. Add another touch of gear to the right. <gasps> another touch of gear to the right. Okay, Stacy, listen to your knees here. Listen to your knees. You don't want to drop back below 80. Can you hold your 80 RPMs? Everybody good to hold their 80 with that next touch of gear. Is that correct? Okay, here we go. You've got one minute here. One minute. I'm only asking you to ride one minute at 80 RPMs, and it's hard. So just stay right there. Good. Mike, quiet your upper body just a little bit. Let your lower body do its job. Great job. Focus on that smooth pedal stroke. Remember how we do it. We think about recruiting in a full perfect circle, not an elliptical, not in an egg shape. It's full perfect circle that comes around. Connect all your dots. Good job. You have 26 more seconds to go at 80. Now remember I said this interval was four minutes. So that means three minutes we're gonna be able to ride a little bit freer at 90. So stay here, 13 more seconds to go. Remember that last touch of gear that you just added at 80 before we started the interval? I'm gonna ask you to take that gear off and to start accelerating 85 to 90 RPMs. Good. The only way you're gonna to go to 90 is if you can hold 90 for three minutes. Great job. So we touched the gear to the left. That meant that we are just working a little bit easier but we may still feel the intensity because we've accelerated. Does that make sense? It's fun, isn't it? It's fun. Good. <laughs> it's, you're sweating, Marsha, that's good. Come on, come on, come on. 30 more seconds to go, you are amazing. Okay, so you're anywhere from 85 to 90. You're gonna keep that 85 to 90. You have two minutes, 23 seconds, we're gonna start dropping the gear back. Do we ever ride with no gear? Absolutely not, absolutely not. We always wanna have the safety of that gear on to keep our pedal stroke smooth. All right, now listen up. You are now 85 to 90 RPMs. You're gonna keep the RPM that you have and you're dropping your gear back slightly to the left. So you're making it slightly easier. Good job, you have a minute here. I mean, that should feel like a little bit of freedom, right? because you're able to keep those pedals going smoothly, but your intensity level either remains the same or it drops slightly back. Excellent job. Will, get your head up there, buddy. I can see everything in that room. Good job. Good. Good job, good job, good job. Hold it right there. Hold it right there, good job. You have 28 seconds to go. So you're 85 to 90, slightly lesser gear so that you feel like you can continue this opportunity. This, uh, this heart rate, this exertion level should be moderately hard to moderate. So we're dropping it back. Good job, eight seconds to go. Good job, good job, good job. Once again, drop a little bit of gear back to the left. Continue your 85 to 90. If you can hold your 90 RPMs for the next minute, beautiful. If you need to stay back at 85, stay there. 
Hold it right there. Awesome job. Awesome job, guys. Hold it right there. 45 seconds to go. So this feels different here because we, we used our intensity level at the front and we started lessening it up as we move forward into the interval. So slightly different feeling. 30 seconds to go. Great job, great job, great job. Hold it right here, please. Hold it right here, please. 20 seconds to go. 20 seconds, 17 to go. Remember how you're feeling right now. Remember this. This should be a moderate level of exertion. Nothing harder, nothing less. Six, five, four, three, two, recover. You now have two minutes to recover. Good job, everybody. Great job, great job, great job, great job. Water towels that should be needed, that should be necessary now, if you were riding at the exertion levels I was suggesting. Good job. Everybody okay? Does anybody need to talk to me? Anybody need to talk to me? Everybody's good. Okay, good. All good. right. Well done, well done, well done. And Tom, I noticed that Will has a mask on. Is that working out for him okay? Seems to be okay. Okay, great. Thank you. Thank you for maybe being so means, on top. Maybe that means he's not working hard enough. I can't believe that of Will. Will's a good worker. Will's a good worker. Okay, guys, that was awesome. You are now 30 minutes into your class. We have approximately 12 to 13 minutes of work in front of us. We will be breaking that up into blocks of intervals, okay? So everyone is good. You have one more minute to recover. If you're not ready to recover, you know that's okay, right? Okay, good. Everyone looks fantastic. Fantastic, fantastic. So let me share what we're gonna be doing the next time. So we're gonna flip what we just did back again. So the hard work will be at 90. The easier work will be at 80, so we're gonna flip that. We've got 30 minutes of easy work, two minutes of hard work, all right? So here we go, 25 more seconds to go. We're gonna start at 80 RPMs again. You're gonna add your gear in enough that you feel like you're having to recruit the tops of those legs. You can feel the hip flexors engage. Remember where the hip flexors are, right where the top of the leg connects to the body. Hamstrings, you guys are looking good. Okay, go ahead, bring it up, 80 RPMs. Let me know when you get there. Let me know when you're ready to begin. Just let me know. Good, Betty, thank you, that is awesome. Good, okay, good. We're gonna, this is going to be a five minute block of work. Good, Marsha, thank you. Okay, so now, we are now at 80 RPMs. We have got 30 seconds at 80. So this just kind of puts you back into the mode, back into the working mode. You could stay here all day long and you would have had a good workout, right? But we're not gonna do that. 80 RPMs, you're feeling moderate intensity being revisited. Now here we go. We're gonna accelerate to 85 or as close to 85 as you can get it. Go now. 85 RPMs, you have two minutes. Good. At any time you feel like you wanna work a little harder, fill. you may wanna to touch a gear to the right, but you still have four minutes of this interval to complete. So may wanna rethink that, wait till the very end. Good job, good job, good job. So you are now working and it's more challenging. Just with that five RPMs, it becomes slightly more challenging. Good. Everybody, quiet your upper body. Shoulders are down, come on, recruit through that upper back, keep yourself working to your potential right here. You are now one minute in. You've only got less than a minute now to work at 85 RPMs and then we're gonna bring it back to 80. So hold it steady, okay? Everybody good? Good job. Vince, get your head up. Can Vince get his head up, please? Yes, I know he can't hear me. Okay, yeah. great, 30 seconds to go. Good job, good job, good job. Yeah, Vince's legs are great. He loves to look at his legs. Okay, 25 seconds to go. You're at 85. So this is moderately to moder moderately challenging work. Is that correct? Okay, good. Good. Right, Phil? I just saw you look at your heart rate, right? Good. 
12 seconds to go. You guys are okay. doing a fantastic job. Keep it right there. Keep it right there. Five seconds to go. Good job. Slowly bring it back to 80. Don't change your gear. Don't add, don't take away. You just have 30 seconds. Good job. Good job, good job. Alrighty, so this is a pullback. So this is like, like, and you're running and then you're walking. And then we're gonna run and then we're gonna walk. So that's how it's gonna feel, okay? So it's this interval training that's so valuable for our heart, our muscles, but the 80 to 90 is great for part our Parkinson's, right? Here we go. Build it up, 90 RPMs. You have two minutes, two minutes. So this is gonna be harder than the previous opportunity, correct? You may not feel it at this moment, but if I ask you again in a minute, you're almost gonna be out of breath. That's how I want you to be working, is that correct? Everybody good? Good. You are now almost 30 seconds in, that means you have 90 seconds to ride at 90. I tell you this all the time, 90 RPMs is so hard to hold. You're doing such a great job, keep it right there. You're amazing. Will, get your head up, buddy. Good job, my friend, good job. Okay, shoulders down, chest up. Carolina, giddy up, Carolina, giddy up. Go a little bit faster. <laughs> keep going, keep going, keep going. Marsha, you're doing great. That's really good. Marsha, broken a sweat, you look great. You're just shining, you look gorgeous. Keep it going. Great job. Nice job, Mike. I see Mike, Mike's awesome. Good job, Stacy. I know you're doing fantastic. Good job, Tom, I know you are too. Hold it, you're almost there. 90 RPMs, that's a 9-0, not 91, Phil, not 92, Phil, it's 90, okay? Hold it right there. Nothing good happens over 90. Good job, you now have 35 more seconds. 35 more seconds, you can do it. Awesome job, 35 more seconds, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Good job, good job, good job, good job. Hold it steady, hold it steady. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. 10, don't leave me. Nine, eight, seven, six, six. don't leave me. Five, four, three, two, 80 RPMs, finish it up. You've got 30 seconds, brilliant job. Remember your intensity level. Remember your gear. Remember your power. Whatever you have to do to remember where to begin on our last interval. Great job, you have 15 more seconds to go. Wonderful job, fantastic job, you guys. Fantastic. Good job, good job, good job. Five seconds to go. Three, two, recover. You now have two minutes to recover. And it should feel like it's a welcome recovery. Is that correct? Good, yes. good. Yeah. That's exactly how it should feel. You are working to that level of success that you find that the recovery is needed and certainly wanted and appreciated. Okay, good. Awesome job, awesome job. Has anyone started to remember this from the last time we did it? I know we change it up all the time. But I think towards the end, you guys start to fall into thinking, oh, I kind of remember when we did this the last time, right? Good. Okay, so we have one more interval to go. Then we'll pull back for the recovery. We'll do some upper body stretches. And then I'll let your, you guys get off the bike and stretch lower body wherever you're at. Now remember, when you stretch lower body, you know exactly what you need to do. One more minute. Okay, so these are fun. These are back to being fun once again. So remember when we went back, we were doing the 30 second push, and then we pull back for 30, and then we push for one minute. We did that two times, right? So it's just gonna be a four minute block of work. That's it. When you get started in four minutes, you're gonna be done, okay? So we don't wanna leave anything on the bike. We don't wanna leave anything on the bike that we thought, oh gosh, I could have maybe worked it just a little bit harder. We don't want that, right? We never want that. Great, but always listen to your body. Okay, I asked you to remember how you felt at that 80 RPMs, remember? 
whether it be your power, whether it be your intensity level, whether it be your uh, gear level. So go to 80 RPMs, start adding in your gear until you can either see power, you've got your gear on board, or you start to feel the intensity begin to change. Is that correct? Yes. Got yeah. it? Okay, great. Super. If that was Betty, thank you, Betty. I appreciate that. ADR and Phil, great job. Okay, Marsha, Carolina, Mike, everybody on board. Stacy, Tom, I hope you guys are on board too. It begins now. You have 30 seconds. 30 seconds at night at 80 RPMs. That's 8 0. Good job. That isn't 78. That's not 79. It's 80. If you want to ride slightly above that, that's fine. Just nothing less than that. Great job. Great job. Okay, here we go. Seven seconds to go. Going up to 90 RPMs. Are you ready? Go. 90 RPMs, accelerate. Now you have to focus on using both legs here. Don't let that dominant leg push you through it. Do both legs. That looks good. That looks really good. 15 seconds to go. This intensity level changes, correct? Intensity level changes. Awesome job. Awesome job. Six, five, four, three, two, pull back. 80 RPMs. I'm going to have you hold that right here. Okay. Touch your gear to the right. You're riding for one minute. Good job. Great job. Touch your gear to the right. Make it a little bit harder at 80. Good job. You have 39 more seconds to ride. 80 RPMs. Oh, and then the fun really begins. So when we first started coming back and meeting each other again, after we've been on our little hiatus, we started working with those aerobic base challenges, these big, those big long blocks of work utilizing our higher level of success in the middle of the class and pulling it back easier at the end. We're back to routine now. We're back to working at the end hard. So in seven seconds, you've added a touch of gear to the right at 80. Here you go. You are going now 90 RPMs for 30 seconds. This level of success is hard, right? This level of success has taken on a new new level this is hard this is hard work whatever you feel is hard work this is it right now it's reflected in your heart rate it's reflected in your power number excellent job four three two pull back 80 don't touch a thing don't touch a thing don't add don't take away hold your 80 rpms for 30 seconds it's going to be 90 for one minute to finish up. Everybody hands in the air. After that last opportunity, as you cross your finish line, you are amazing. Okay, hold it right here. How's your intensity level? Phil, is it good? Yes? Okay, here we go. Three, two, 90 RPMs. Go faster for one minute. Good job, good job, good job. So at the end of this minute, you should be working very hard, maybe even on the edge of breathlessness. Are you there? Work hard, work hard, now hold it. Do not go faster than 90. Stay right at 90. You've got 36 more seconds. Here we go, 30 seconds to go. You are now at 90 RPMs. You are pushing yourself past the finish line. Great job. Great job, 25 seconds, Marcia, you're looking good. Good job, good job, good job. Come on, come on, come on, shoulders down. Will, get your head up, buddy. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 15 seconds to go. Yeah. All across the finish line together in 10 seconds. Here we go, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Slow it down, hands up in the air. Awesome job, woo! That's what I'm talking about right there. Nice work, nice work, nice work. <laughs> Take your gear off. Total recovery now. Drop below 70. Woo! 
Yay. Whoa. Yay, team. Awesome job, guys. Awesome, awesome work. Oh, I'm so proud of you guys. Brilliant Welcome job. back, Carolina. Way to go. <laughs> yep. awesome, that first, that's awesome work. First. Good. Oh. Tom, I'm going to unmute you now. Okay. <laughs> Carolina, I'm unmuting you, too. I don't care if you're, if you're, um, and I'm asking to unmute Marsha. Good job. We've got everybody on board. Woo! Way to rock that. Good job. Yeah. So you should feel right now that you got a hard workout. Is that correct? That's what we want. We want you to have worked hard. Okay, good. All righty. Okay. Start keeping it slowing down, slowing down, slowing down. Okay. Hi, Tom. Good job. Drop your hands down to the side. Let's roll our shoulders to the back. Three. Bye, Will. Bye, Will. You said bye. Bye, bye. And one. Good job. Hands drop down to our side. Let's bring our hands behind us. Lace our fingers or hook our fingers underneath the back of our saddle. Drop your shoulders down, squeeze tension between the shoulder blades. Lift up your chest like you're really proud of yourself because you should be. You are amazing. Good job, take a deep breath. And release it out, good job. As we take our hands away, drop them down again, shake them out, we're gonna take our left arm across our body, okay? Left arm comes across your body, stretch. Drop your shoulders down, feel the release of all intensity right through that upper back. You know how strong our upper back gets when we ride. And come all the way out and release it down. Let's bring our opposite arm across, hold, draw it in like you're giving yourself a hug right here. Good job. Good job, and slowly release it. Drop it down again. We're gonna do one shoulder roll up and back, great. Now you're going to take your left arm down and you're going to hold the bottom of your saddle. Just hold it. You're going to reach out with your opposite arm and you're just going to lean to the side. You're going to stretch out through your oblique, drop your shoulder down, try to get your ear next to your bicep. Reach up and float it down. Good. Good. Other side. Reach up. Shoulder stays in its pocket and lean to the side. Great work. And come all the way up and float it down again. Okay, if available, one, both arms go up with the inhale, and both arms come down with the exhale. Give yourself a hand, you guys were awesome. Thank you so much for joining us today. Let me know what you think, okay, as we uh, sign off. And I'm gonna see you on Thursday. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. You're all oh, my pleasure. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I did great. Thank you. Bye-bye now. Bye. Thank you.